Let's see, will it work now? At least with Farfetch, just that like little leak that he hits you with. Oh yeah, the little leak. That, that gives him a little more, um, a little, a little more, more charm. Something unique. I think he has like a signature item called Stick, and it just like doubles his crit rate or something. All right, this should be a really interesting match. Ooh, Zelda. I know, I know a Zelda player. He was actually in this tournament. He didn't do too well. That's uh, unfortunate. But again, I can't, I can't talk myself. I got, I got destroyed twice. <laughs> That's not good, dude. All right, let's see. They hand wrap the drum right into it. Looks like. All right. So we saw Click Clack earlier with a really clutch finish against the Pichu. Um, I forgot Pichu's name. I think it was Chrome. Oh, uh, really clutch. He threw an F smash and then started shielding because he knew the Pichu tried to punish. As soon as the um, he parried, I wish he parried up B, and that was up B is kill move, and it was really stylish, really hype. Yeah, we got, it was cool. We got style in this tournament. That's good to hear. Yes, we do. All right. So I was throwing out a stand, but just like a punching ghost, not really doing much. No, there we no, go. I lost that. <laughs> I won the one for <laughs> you. Oh, you gotta be careful with those uh, teleports. If you're doing too much, you become predictable. Yep, yep. Yeah, one thing I want to say is Spear has definitely a bit of an advantage here. I know Spear was commentating. Huh? <laughs> Quick got class match. Yo, I'm up. Alright. Let's talk to you. Yeah. So, you too. Alright. Alright, who wants to, um,. He wants to try their best. Uh, wedge. <laughs> no headset. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, no, I was just checking. All right, sweet. All right, so what do we got here? We got Zelda versus Zelda. Yeah. Interesting matchup. I feel like Zelda probably just gets stomped. Um, but I can see where she might, like, why she has... Is the neutral B invincible at startup, or...? Um, I don't know, I think it might be. Because I, I played against a Zelda player earlier in Bracket, and it felt like a lot of the answers to, like, the hard pressure situations, like the pressure Wolf would put on, in, like, here, you can neutral B out of a lot of stuff, and if they're not looking for it. Problem is, like, right there, once you whiff it, it has a long recovery. So, it's like a temporary answer, I feel. Maybe so. Ducks the uh, buster. Using, yeah, using those ducks. It's a nice little bit of a uh, Niles right there. I don't think anything can do that. Yeah, apparently you can duck under. Nice back there. Good spacing. Not quite gonna kill. Man, those zoom-ins are so disrespectful. Oh yeah. I love it. Probably, probably one of the greatest um, things they added to this game. Was the was the slowdown like the hit stop there? Yeah. Yep. Pretty good. In general, this game added a lot more hit stuff than like the predecessors here, but especially like with the cinematic moments, it makes for a very interesting like camera work in the game. Yeah, Spiro just uh, SD. He did that in the last game too, so he definitely needs to be careful. Yeah, Zelda. The one thing Zelda does have is her like forward smash and up smash. They got a lot of kill potential, so <laughs> it's rough if you SD against this character. Although Wolf himself, he's he's getting in kill percent for down smash, forward smash. Yeah, he's basically. But if he doesn't screw every screw this up, he pretty much has this match. Yeah, I'd say. Then again, we are commentators, and we could so like, lay the curse. We could commentary, on him. Chris. Yes, we could. Okay, yep. well spaced back air. Not going to survive that. Nice little foot and to the face. Spear's going to go up 1-0. All right, so one zero for Spear. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Nice. So yeah, I said that one last time, but it didn't. It didn't. Connect. Didn't quite come out. Yeah. <laughs> So it looks like they're gonna go battlefields. Ooh, battlefields. So this could be this could be interesting in terms of uh, if he stays on Zelda. If he stays on Zelda, it's the one thing every space he has problems with, right? Wolf, Fox, Falco, is the recovery, and you want to recover onto the stage sometimes. It's safer than going to the ledge. Mm -hmm. But the one thing is the battlefield platform is gonna interrupt that. I believe Zelda's up smash should reach platforms, so he has to be careful how he recovers here. Oh, and having all these platforms, if the guy knows how to do it, Zelda could, could teleport cancel around him, which would yeah. definitely help out with his movement. Teleport cancel, or you could even plant a knight on one of the platforms and just like use that to edge guard like mid and low. Yeah, just command a bunch of space. Yeah. Gonna have to try using a neutral. I don't know about that choice, but. It's not a good idea. I feel like it's a just nice parry. Nice Gotta get the punish right from the there. triple jab. 
Well spaced back there is going to clutch out the first stock. Zelda needs to be careful. Those teleports only go so far. Once you figure out the, uh, the distance, you can, tell, you can um, capitalize. Yeah, it's like it's, it's a bit of a gimmick, right? If people don't know the Zelda matchup. They're just going to try to, especially they're going to try to press buttons after the teleport. And you can do the neutral B with Zelda, and you're pretty much going to be safe in most grounded situations after your teleport finishes. If they're not, if they don't have like a really on-point punish shoot. Let's be careful getting up. Fully charged down smash is going to take out another stock from Zelda. This is uh, going to be a three stock right here. Maybe unless Not someone careful. turns around really fast. It's hard to make. It's hard to plan a comeback on a lot of characters that are like good characters right now. Not only because they rack up crazy amounts of damage, but they all kill early, man. Like Ike kills early, Wolf kills early, and an SD in this game is hard. No, it's terrifying. I know. This is game two. Game two. Dash attack. Those teleports are killing you, man. Click clack, you gotta be careful. Okay. <laughs> now we're starting to use them for good. They do. For this exact reason. Although I've seen two Zeldas today, so you don't know, man. Maybe they know something we don't know. Well, whatever they know, they better, they better throw it out soon. Okay. That's well, going to get the kill one. off the top. All right. So, <laughs> using a lot of teleport there, I really don't think that's a safe option, especially at this percent. Even if it even if it works, it's a huge risk if it doesn't pay off. Huge risk. I think that's... Oh. So that's some life left. Through the platform. Gets him a safe recovery. Got to be careful spot dodging against Wolf. A lot of his smashes stay out for a long time. They do a lot of damage and they do a lot of knockback. Is that going to be the kill throw? Not quite. It needs to be about like 160, 165 to get that to kill probably. Blocks the forward tilt. Doesn't quite get the sweet spot on the down air. That's it. Sweet spot's back air and that's going to be the game. Spear wins. dominating. Spear wins 2-0. Do we get the shell? Um, we, we got the shell. We are we are here at the. Do I do? I do